Hey, listen, to, listen to this, man. Brian says, kjumpersuk.com is the best site on the internet, and if you don't look at it, it's going to tangle you. All right, so look at it and make sure you look at it. Sorry I can't see you, but I haven't got my hearing aid on. <laughs> All right, um, K Jammers UK. We're joined now by legend Steve Dossett. Steve, thanks for taking the time to chat with us. Okay. Um, you've been around a long time, beating the Jake, uh, the likes of Jake Boswick, yeah. Robert Powell. Yeah. Great career so far. Yeah, still um, going good. You got a lot of fights coming yeah. up in the future. You're yeah. fighting tonight. I'm fighting tonight. I'm fighting Reese Watson tonight. Yeah. yeah. A good fighter. Yeah, yeah. I fought him before. I got draw by him. But um, it should be different tonight, yeah. It'll be a good fight though, yeah. Just looking forward yeah, to it. Yeah. How's your training been going? Going really well. I trained down Maximus in Frimley at the moment with um, Ben Rickwood, um, Dan Jenny. Um, just, yeah, we're doing loads of strength and conditioning, just fitness, um, pad work, loads of everything really. Doing a lot of MMA as well, um, doing a lot of groundwork as well. So yeah, I've got to go a fight in two weeks as well. It's, course, it's so, yeah. important groundwork. Yeah, 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 I'm doing yeah. everything at the moment. This is a Dosset gym. This is yours and your dad's. It's me and my dad's gym, yeah, in Hersham. We're doing it like one day a week at the moment and we're going to build up to two days a week. But we're um, just starting off with kids and a few adults. It's amateurs, really. We're doing, doing a few of our own little shows. I mean, there as well, in Hersham as well, yeah. um, just, for, just for the amateurs who want to get into the cage or, or the professional arena later on in life, you know, yeah. just to start them off, yeah. yeah. Well, that was yeah. my next question, because we went to an event last week down yeah. in Ashford in Kent, yeah. and we saw some strike and grapple. The kids yeah. were about nine or ten years yeah, old, yeah. and the standard was, yeah. I mean, can you see yeah. this, like, kids getting oh, into Oh, I it can now. do, yeah, yeah, I can do, yeah, but as long as it's, it's done in, like, um, not in nightclubs and stuff. It's done in proper halls and venues that are not not catered for with drink and that, you know, mixing with drink as well. Because when people are drinking and watching kids, they're going to get violent. Yeah, you know? it's a lot of drugs. As long as, as it's well, controlled, it's, yeah, controlled. Yeah. I don't mind kids doing it as long as like it's controlled environment, not with people drinking and on drugs, like you say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah, drinking drugs a lot, you know, yeah. it's a bad. But I mean, well, yeah. You find a lot of like naughty kids get into MMA and it sort of yeah. sorts them it out. It does sort them out. I've got a few kids at the moment that are quite quite bad at school and that, and it's sorting them right out. They've they've been since they've been training with me, they've been gone right up 100. percent They've improvement. They've been going to school. It just takes takes some of them. have got a lot too much energy and they can't. There's nothing to do after school. When they're with me, they take I, I strain them so hard that they've they, they've got no time really to go out and cause trouble after they're that's so what, tired. You know, I mean that's where yeah. the politics come in. MMA is yeah. a dangerous cage and yeah. all that, but it's, yeah. but it's not, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. It isn't a if it's done the wrong way. Like if you do, if you do go on the street and fight people on the street, but if it's done in a proper environment, it's okay. It's brilliant for the kids to get into. And I think it's a lot safer sometimes than boxing and that because it's like it's you do you're wrestling as well as punching. It's it's totally different things. You're learning both sides of the game, the martial arts and the stand up, the boxing and the kickboxing as well. Just not just the boxing. You're learning everything. You know, yeah. you got to turn turn your hands at everything. You know. Yeah. So it's, yeah. it's a really good thing yeah. for the yeah. to get into. Um, you're fighting tonight. Yeah. And you're fighting again in two weeks. Two weeks in Colchester. Yeah. Um, I'm fighting Marlon Hunt two weeks for British British MMA title. Right, so if yeah. people want to get tickets for that, how would they? Yeah, um, just go to um, my um, go to um, Facebook, Steve Dossett. Um, go on that and just, uh, get tickets through that. You can do, yeah. Brilliant. Yeah, you, I mean, Steve, you've been around quite a few years now. Yeah. So from the, uh, your early days when you first yeah. started yeah. to the to the standards now, yeah. What do you think? Uh, do you think the standards really improved from the early days? Well, I think so. Yeah, because I think the reason reason is that there's more, so many more clubs you can go to. And um, so many more people doing it. It's more promotions about. Um, it's more. It's it's got into more that you see on TV more from America and that UFC. Yeah. Um, but there's so many more clubs and there's so many more promotions. Everyone's doing promotions, so everyone can get into it now and have a little go doing starting the amateur and then if they're good enough, go to professional. You know. Yeah. But yeah. It's so it's so much more easy to get into. It's a big thing because I yeah. mean the UFC now are talking about yeah. opening a, a branch in the UK, yeah. but I don't know. Really, what, is that good for the sport? Really, because I mean, we've got our own thing in England, don't we? So yeah, I think it's just really yeah. Stay over there, and we've got our own things over here. Like we've got UCMA, yeah. um, cage rage, yeah, cage rage, yeah. things like that. And then if you get better than that, then you can go over there and fight UFC, can't you? So yeah, I, think, I mean, yeah, it's like rather than trying to get over here and do the thing over trying to get a bit of us as well. But I think we should just stay as a 
it on your own, you know, and then go over there going to fight if you want to, you know. Yeah, because I mean, it's, yeah. it is big in the mind. It's still yeah. not as big as it is in America, no, no. Brazil, places. I think like it's more that. bigger over there because they do it at school, don't they? They did the wrestling at school and out in America. They say, well, they start for the wrestling over here. We we just got we got football and rugby, and we we, yeah, we, don't, we, yeah, did, we used to do boxing, well. but we don't do boxing no more, do we? No. But it's not many kids really get into it when they're really young, do they? Except for now, they starting to now because of UFC and stuff, and because it's big, getting bigger on the yeah. TV. It's like the and old the films. Well. You get the films. You get the films come out now, aren't you? Yeah. It's quite good. Yeah, yeah, there's uh, yeah. Um, this one I seen the other day, it was advertised about a MMA Warrior. film. Warrior, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, yeah, brilliant film. Warriors, so, isn't it? Warriors, yeah, brilliant film. Is it? You yeah, said it, yeah, yeah, brilliant film, yeah. Is, um, so the tr is your training changed much since when um, you first started? Is, do you have to train? Yeah, I was doing more boxing before, but now I'm doing a lot more, I'm doing a lot more what I saw I wasn't good at before, a lot more grappling and wrestling, um, yeah, doing more of that and... Um, just doing a lot. I've just always been fit anyway. It's just gonna keep my fitness level really high. So that's it. Yeah. So tonight, you'll yeah. you'll fight tonight. Will you be staying here tonight, or will you go home tonight? I'll stay here tonight. Yeah, I always stay here, stay the night. Or I'll come down the night before. This is only around the corner for me because I live around the corner. It's just handy this venue. But usually I always come come the day before and stay the same night, two nights, or I can stay that night down there. So uh, what's your record now? It's my record's um, K1 15 and 0 so far. So that's a really yeah, good record. Yeah, it is, yeah. yeah. So you can hopefully carry yeah, on Yeah, boxing, I think it's 17 and 9. And MMA, it's 6 and 4. Yeah, MMA's yeah, different. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we can win and lose in MMA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. MMA. All my losses have been on the ground, but my groundwork is picking up now and I'm doing a lot more to um, improve what my weakness is. So I will, you will see a difference. So you will see a difference in my grappling, a lot of difference. How do, you, how do you fancy the fight? Well, you never know, two weeks time I might be British champion, you know, and there you go, innit, yeah? That's well deserved, though. Yeah, so. of course, yeah, I put, every, I put everything into my training, and fighting is my life, is my life, you know. And obviously training yeah. others, I mean, yeah. do you train others at uh, Maximus, Jim, yeah. as well? I do, I just... do classes at Maximus, yeah, I do private lessons at Maximus, and um, I've got a few youngsters um, that are quite, they're coming up, they're getting quite good. Um, little Gypsy Lad is quite good. Any um, names you want to John McFadden, to? John McFadden, look out for him, he's good, he's a good little fighter. Um, Tom Booth, good little fighter. Um, ben Chapman, good fighter. Um, few few boys, whoever I've missed, I'm sorry I've, I've missed anyone, but yeah, there's, there's a few boys are coming up here, yeah, they're good, yeah. And they're all coming through, yeah, they're yeah, yeah, yeah. so a yeah. great base to, yeah. for, for them to start yeah. from with you, because you've got yeah. so much experience. Yeah. On oh, we've, when I see, I'll try and give my lodge, I'll do a little bit of sparring with them, yeah, but yeah, I'll try and give, give them a few points, but some of them, or even give me a couple of little cracks and that, you know, give me yeah. a little cheap shots, you well, know, little, and then you little, know they're little, getting good, yeah. Little leg shakers. Yeah, that's it, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, all the best tonight, okay. mate. We'll be watching. Um, oh, brilliant. We're going to be doing a write-up, so yeah. I'm hoping, yeah. I don't want to be uh, yeah. a buy or anything, but I'm hoping yeah. I'm putting you as a winner on the yeah. show tonight. Yeah, you, oh, you will be, yeah. Thanks for uh, yeah. doing the interview. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Thanks a lot, cheers. and good luck with Thanks. Gossip Jimmy yeah. and everything tonight. Okay, cheers, okay. thank you. Thank you very thank much. You. Brilliant. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah.